Hey, what's up guys? Kareem Jovian. Welcome to my channel. As you all know, I'm here in Turkey, Istanbul, and I'm loving it. I'm loving the people, the food, the atmosphere, the colors. Everything is so rich, but there is something that I've noticed that put me a little off, and I didn't know why this was happening. I don't know what's going on, but for some reason, a lot of the animals here... Now, don't get me wrong. Turkey loves animals, and I love that about them. They are so animal-friendly and they literally say that the world belongs to the animals too, not just the humans, and I love that. But I see a lot of the dogs and cats just laying on the ground, especially the dogs, exhausted. Like, I don't know, I've never seen this before. To be honest, I thought they were dying or they're, or they're already dead. I mean, hopefully not, but it's something that really scared me and shocked me, and, and I was afraid to approach the dogs. So no one really told me anything about it, I don't know what's going on. They do look like they're suffering from exhaustion or just simply thirsty and hungry. It is really hot here in Turkey and very humid. I'm kind of scared that these animals might be really sick. I thought it would be really cool to kind of help them out. I've seen a lot of people help them out, making them shelters, uh, putting food and actually giving them water. But for some reason, I've all the dogs that I've seen were just laying down I don't know if they're trying to be lazy or what it is, but they look healthy and big, which is weird. To me, they look exhausted and tired and so sad. And there was one dog that just looked at the, the look in his eyes. It's just so, oh, it just got my heart. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to help out as many dogs as I can here in Turkey before I leave. Because I would imagine with the heat and the humidity that they are thirsty. The reason why I think they might be actually thirsty is because we tested it out with one, one dog. I gave him some water from my water bottle and... Uh, it didn't seem like he wanted it at first, but after a while when he felt comfortable around us and trusted us, he started to drink the water uh, off the ground and I felt so bad because I didn't have anything like this to put it in. I hope many of you guys do this because these animals are precious and they're lovely and they're man's best friend. I have a close affinity with dogs because I've been, I grew up around them and especially uh, those big dogs, you know, uh, my dad used to have one and it protected him every time he was at his home. Uh, it would always be outside, he'd always feed it, and it was a great dog, and sadly it passed away, but the dog was amazing, and that's why I love dogs, so, like, I love cats too, but I love all animals, so let's go help out these dogs, and I hope you guys enjoy this video, if you enjoyed it, remember to hit that like button, subscribe, and share the video, so maybe somebody else who watches this video will do the same thing, and uh, remember, animals are everything, and we need to take care of them.